Someone threw a rock at my head and as I turned around, I saw nothing. And I mean nothing. I didn't know what's scarier, the fact that I realized I had didn't had multiplayer on or the fact that I remembered Jackson passed away from cancer two weeks ago. The lake was so clear. It was so clear, I could see what pulled her under. I couldn't understand why my dog suddenly refused to go into the woods, until I heard it. The trees were screaming. I scream, you scream. Why is there a finger in my ice cream? We smiled proudly as our daughter went on her bus for her first day of school. Our hearts dropped when the real bus arrived two minutes later. I looked out my window. The stars had gone away. You sit down in the toilet at midnight, still half sleep. Then you hear the rat screeching. Please, I'm sorry, the boogeyman screamed while sprinting away from that crooked house. It was eventually cornered as the child he thought going to be its dinner unhinged his jaws in a wide grin. I was getting used to the fact that everything I knew was just a dream. But then the bombshell dropped that I wasn't the one dreaming. Have you ever seen those dolls that kill people at night? Well, you have now. My mother died feeding me. My life as spider is great. I watched you play whilst at the park. I'll come to your house when the day goes dark. I had a dream that a man was watching me sleep from outside my bedroom window. When I woke up, I found footprints. Inside, next to my bed. When I smiled, she did not smile back. Something is very wrong with this mirror. I'm lucky enough to not have any skeletons in my closet. No, the meat that was on them is in the freezer and the bones themselves have been crushed down and sent to be sold at the local pharmacy. The voices led us deeper and deeper into the huge cave system. It wasn't until a great crimson beast leapt out and bit off my friend's head, did I realize those voices were never human. As I entered the room full of corpses and saw the little boy running toward me, his little arms held out, crying mommy. I knew what I had to do. So, I picked him up and hugged him, whispered, God bless you, child, and twisted his head to the right hard enough to break his neck, before he could sink his tiny fangs into my neck. My news team flew our chopper into the outskirts of West City as we looked at clothings of the missing citizens in one of the streets. I felt something jab into my back. Then I felt myself disappear as I saw my friends vanish into thin air, while their clothing floated to the ground. Bodies dropped one by one, until he held a shotgun to my neck. As his body dropped and my friend reassured my safety, all I could think was, God damn it Hank, this is the third time this week. He couldn't believe that three beautiful women were fighting for his attention. As he pulled a golden apple from his pocket that said for the fairest, he realized why they were here. Whenever I turn away from the mirror, I always feel I'm being watched. I never wanted to harm a human. But as my girlfriend tore off a piece off my skin during a fight, revealing my true skin, I had to kill her before she could tell humanity about us. What if thunder is not what it seems? What if it's the roars of ancient beasts that fight each other to the death? There is no reason to be afraid she said. She didn't realize that I could clearly see the blood in the corner of her mouth. The townspeople are always happy to see me. No wonder, my blood is the only thing to keep the creatures satisfied. I just spotted two new stars, and they're green. They're kind of close together, it looks a bit like their eyes. It's getting warmer. I shake in terror as I watch the atomic blast approaching me. My wife and I just had a big fight, but she still brought me an ice cold beer. Must be a new brand, I swear it smells like bitter almonds. I assumed my neighbor had lost his sense of smell due to COVID. Otherwise, he would have smelled the gas leak before lighting his cigarette. My roommate is completely deaf, and I'm absolutely okay with it. Luckily, he's not curious enough to check the basement. I don't mind working at a cemetery. I just wish they'd stop scratching at their coffin lids. 
I never understood why people disliked pigs so much. They can get rid of your victims without a trace. I always wondered why the crying boy was painted that way, why would anyone paint a crying child? Maybe he knows of his curse, and cries because he cannot stop it? Why is Friday the 13th considered unlucky? I committed all my murders on a Friday the 13th, and I haven't been caught yet. Introducing the Hunchy. A scrunchie made of human skin, it holds your hair up so much better. I don't know what's worse, a Wikipedia article highlighting all of my failures, or the fact that someone changed my status from alive to dead some minutes ago. I never enjoyed sticking my hand into big bags or tight spaces. What if something grabs me from the other side? Stranger danger. The kid shouts after I tried to pull him away. I'm pushed over by bystanders as the kid's mother slowly lifts the knife above her son's head. What if the beeping we sometimes heard in our ears was not denied us, but actually, a higher force trying to contact us? I've never seen a dead body before. It's my first time, and I can't help but be shocked about how hungry the smell made me. I like to think of myself as an anglerfish. Recordings of my last victim's screams lure the next one in. I'm so hungry, I thought as my blind date kept blabbing on and on about what he wanted from a woman. When he finally passed out from the pills I put in his drink, I asked the waiter to please help me get my date out to the parking lot, where I propped him up behind the steering wheel and showed him what I wanted from a man. This thing about vampires not being able to enter a residence where they aren't invited in makes my afterlife complicated. How am I supposed to protect my sister from her abusive husband breaking down the front door if she won't let me in through the kitchen door? Mommy's home. Cried my six-year-old niece as we heard the knock on the door and my sister's voice asking to be let in. I ran across the room and grabbed the child before she could open the door, ignoring her protests and tears, because we had just come home from her mother's funeral. My parents have always told to watch both ways before crossing the street. Good thing those school children weren't told the same. As the hurricane raged outside Evan sat huddled in a corner of his house. At first, he felt safe, but then he remembered that his house was on the edge of a mountainside. At school Freddy's classmates made fun of him. But they stopped a few days later once the bullets started flying. Ellie loved to watch TV with her grandmother. That was until the day their show was interrupted by a news report of a missing child and Ellie saw her face on the TV screen. The dead don't speak. That's why I'm typing this. I liken the bogeyman. He's the one who's protecting me every time my stepmom touches me. Some thugs broke into my house last night. Well at least I won't have to buy meat for some time. Sometimes, to get what you want, you have to sacrifice your principles. I say, plunging the ceremonial blade into Principal Wilson's heart. I am happy that my neighbor became an actor. The other neighbors believed that the blood-curdling scream they heard last night was a scene he was rehearsing for instead of me stabbing him to death. I told my child this was like playing hide and seek. I just hope the killer doesn't find us. I ran from the creature chasing me. How have I not crashed into anything yet I'm blind? After much thought, I decided that it was time to come out of the closet to my family. When I opened the closet door, I saw the clock on the wall said 5 o'clock and the sun horribly burned my hand, forcing me back in. The astronaut had survived the crystal aberration, returns to Earth, and was picked by rescue team. His family keep his secret, that his eyes become briefly brighter with unnatural color. When my friends warned me to get back off from the river, they're shouting that an alligator was near. But all of us got more terrified when two giant claws appeared and strikes the alligator into bloody explosion, its body parts flying out from the water. The legend about knights fighting dragons is a terrible lodge. The metal armor can't protect the knights from a huge fire-breathing winged creature. The suits were created to protect them from something more humanoid with fangs. He dug himself out of the dirt and looked at the human who was trapped him there. 
You think you can just kill me like that? Ashley looked at the beast its rabbit yet human looking body as it ripped her apart. As my date showed me around his house, I was amazed by all of the life-sized, realistic, mannequins. That is until I saw one with my name on it, and realized that the mannequin's skin wasn't plastic. Is everything alright here sir? The man said as I glanced up from my trunk. Yeah, just had to get something out of here. I said holding a knife to the tied up, hostage's throat. This date was incredible, I never want it to end. My date said, resting her head against my shoulder. Don't worry, it won't. I said as I glanced at my finger, which was hovering over the lock button. I heard the noise from outside grow louder and louder as the monster approached. I knew it had arrived when my mom said in a sob daddy's home. After our first son was born, I told my husband I wanted to give him siblings to play with and he nodded in agreement. I thought that he would stop bringing babies home after a while, but I'm not complaining since our son loves all of his new brothers and sisters. I clicked on the video in my subscription feed. Hi, I'm Pandora. Welcome to my unboxing video. She wept as she watched her city got raised. Cassandra had warned them to be wary of Greeks bearing gifts. Everyone complimented the bodies that were outside my house, saying it gave it an extra touch of chills. Maybe I can use them next year, it would be even cooler seeing that they'd hopefully be skeletons by then. Please like our video and subscribe to our channel, so you won't miss out any of our future videos. Thank you for your support. This is Reddit Joe channel, your everyday Reddit.